Hey y'all, this is Ashley with JNA Travel Adventures, and in this video, I'm going to give you a tour and my honest evaluation of the over the water suites at Simondon Valley. Now, please be aware we have no affiliation whatsoever with Simondon Valley, and what I say is really what I feel about the units. Also, if you find this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more about our trips in the Maldives and other places, please subscribe so you won't miss out. Hubby and I stayed in Unit 723 of the Over the Water Suites at Simondon Valley. The 723 is an ocean-facing unit, which means that we got the sunset. It means we had more waves. We have more wind and we saw more ocean creatures in the hole in the floor and our balcony than the units on the bay side. Now let's go inside our suite and see how relaxing it all is. When you first walk in, there is the coffee bar and the um, refrigerator. Start with many, many goodies. This screen actually opens up and leads to the, the lounge room, the living room, the second bedroom, and I'll show that to you in a minute. In the, in the bedroom, you have a great king-size bed with the cute little mats. Each side of the bed has its own reading light attached to the wall, has a light lamp itself, has a cute nightstand that has a drawer, and then what's really fun for me is that it has two USB ports that you can use to charge whatever you need to charge. The room also has a TV with a cute chest and drawers, so there's much storage. You can lay in bed and have this amazing view anytime you like. If you choose to sleep in, there are very good blackout curtains that allows you to sleep in also. For some extra activity area, writing area, things like that, they've got a desk. On the desk, they include some important things. They include a um, air freshener if you want to change how it smells and make it smell tropical, a little flashlight, there are matches, and of course, in our environment right now, they provide hand sanitizer. Over on the other side of this little alcove, there's a great bench that you can put your suitcases on with a little storage area underneath it where we short st have been storing our shoes. They also have included a full size ironing board for all of us who like to iron and there's an iron in the closet. So let's open up this closet which is full of goodies. The closet area is full of goodies and is also a perfect size for a week worth of clothes. Let's open it up and show you what all they have. On the top shelf, we found our full iron, which has steam and normal straight dry cleaning, great. Then you have a safe, so you can put all your valuables and your passports in there. They also have, if you choose to send your laundry out, they have um, a laundry bag that you can send it out. They have multiple tags to say whether you want privacy in your room or whether you want your room cleaned because they will provide daily cleaning of your room and if you're in the water suites you get daily chocolates too because we have such a great access to water out here on the balcony they provide for us two life jackets which actually we pulled out and they're comfortable fitting for american sizes including hubby who is you know six three and then they provide two pairs of flip-flops, so feel free to use theirs and not have to bring your own. And finally, this was important to me, they provide two very nice raincoats. 
I don't want to have to pull them out, but they are, I've already taken one out and they're a good size. So therefore you do have no need to bring your own umbrella or your raincoat and take up space in your suitcase because they've already got done it for you. Now let's open up the other side of the closet. They provide you with extra pillows and a blanket in case you want to use the second bedroom slash couch in there or if you'd like to prop up with a whole bunch of pillows. But let me tell you, the pillows of the bed are nice and sturdy and are very good feeling. They also provide you for two robes that you can sit out on the balcony or just enjoy after a nice cool shower. Um, they're the waffle type and they're long sleeves, so you're all very comfortable, but you're not overly hot. Finally, there are two drawers on either side, which are perfect for your, tool, your lingerie and your foldable items. There's plenty of space for all of that. Now let's go into the bathroom. I feel the bathroom is rather spacious and well set up. When you first walk in, you can't help it but notice the view. It just makes any bathroom better. But let's talk about what they provide. Um, when you walk in to the right is a rack where they provide your beach towels. Those are the towels you use for the pool, out off of your deck, the beach, things like that. They also provide very comfy, luxurious bath towels, bath sheets, hand washes. The other thing that I found was really ingenious to have in this room is this tree stand. I heard somebody say that it was a piece of artwork. No, it's actually a clothes dryer. So it's artistic, I give you that, but I've been using it with my scrubba, which I've described in their videos, and I'll have a link to this below so you can actually go get your own. So I've been washing my clothes with the scrubba and then taking this wonderful tree stand outside on the deck and drying the clothes, and they dry in a flash. You also can have bathing suits, things like that. Now let me show you the crown jewel of this bathroom, and it is this large two-person tub. And I'm saying American-sized people, two-person tub. So you fill it up. It has a really neat headrest that's a foam headrest I've never seen before, and it is just so enjoyable to sit here and then open those doors, which this whole wall of glass will completely open up, and then you can sit there and just relax and enjoy the ocean outside. It is wonderful at sunset because we face sunset, so you can have a bath and watch the sunset. Then let's talk about your necessities because they make the necessities in this bathroom even nicer than they have to be. So you have a complete room with a glass door for your toilet area. You also have your bidet if you're a bidet person. The shower, I love the stone on the back drop, but the stone shower, you have two shower head choices. They have a shower head that you can take off the wall. Then they have the rain shower head, which is so nice to use when you get out of the ocean to just come in here and just be completely washed off. It is luxurious and refreshing. They also provide shampoo and conditioner for you to use, as well as, I'll show you in a minute, all the rest of the amenities. I was really surprised with all the amenities they provide. It just makes my, would have made my packing so much easier to know don't bring this and don't bring that because they're going to provide it for you. So let me show you. Out here, they have a little stool, which you can put in the shower if you want to, or you can leave it out here. I use it as a great place to put towels. Then let's talk about the sink area. They have the trough style sink, which is for two and is very easy to use. The water, it's got good pressure, things like that. They also have provided um, hand soap and hand lotion out here. But let's talk about these drawers. This drawer is your stocked drawer that you get from the resort. And so in it, they provide a loofah that you can use in your in the bathtub or wherever. They provide a comb. Isn't this comb just as cute as could be? It's bamboo. We just thought that was adorable. They provide a razor and shaving cream. They have a vanity set. They have a really nice sewing set. 
they provide you with two toothbrushes, two toothbrushes and toothpaste. Then we've already been through a tube of this and asked for more and they'll give you as much as you need. It's the aloe vera. So when you get too hot and sunburned, this felt so nice on my skin to just kind of cool off in the evening with. They provide also two shower caps and their soap is the milled soap, which was just a great smell and had a good feel to it. Then you have the normal things that are must-haves, including the stain stick, which I have to travel with. So you have a small drawer like this above your sink, and then you have two large drawers underneath, and they work by pushing on them, where you can store a lot of your items that you would normally keep in your bathroom. With that said, as our house works, hubby, if he cannot see it, it does not exist. So as I've talked about before, I always have my hang vertical hanging travel kit, which I'll have a link to where I got it from. That This is what keeps our house sane because hubby in here has his deodorant and things, and if he can see it, then he can use it and he's not having to ask about it. Finally, they have a mirror, which you can use for putting on makeup. It's the double-sided mirror. And they provide you with the hair dryer. Granted, let me tell you now, the hair dryer blows about as strong as the wind outside. And I like a uh, stronger hair dryer, so I brought my own, and I'll tell you about the one I brought later. Anyway, this is a hair dryer if you need one. Another very important point is that, do you see that outlet? It is the, this whole resort is 220 and British style. So if your plug does not look like that, you're gonna need one of these. We have picked these up years ago and they actually do all of the different types of, of outlet plugs you need. And this is what I use for my hair dryer in here so that I get to be the happy. The final area of the suite is this living room or second bedroom. It can be used either way. This suite is designed that you could put four people in it. I really like it's designed to two, but if you want to put other people in it, like small kids, it is has feasible capability for that. In this room, you have the TV and the same cute chest you had in the main bedroom, which has a shelf and two um, drawers so that you can put things to, to store in there. The highlight of the room, of course, is the hole in the floor. Granted, the table is supposed to be on top of the hole, but the minute we got here, we had to move the table because we just have had the best time watching for fish. Since we've been here between five and eight at night, we have seen sharks, we've seen parrotfish, we've seen huge tunas, we've seen so many other types of fish. So for us, what we've been doing is that we literally take the great pillows that they have in this room and we put them on the floor and we lay on the floor and watch all the wildlife just go in and out. You also have in this room a really comfy chair which has an ottoman with it. I've just moved the ottoman out of the way. And then you have this couch slash bed. Now, the first day we were here, I was exhausted, jet lag, all those things, and so I just kind of threw all those pillows on the floor and slept on that. It is definitely big enough for one adult, possibly two adults if you squish in there, and it sleeps phenomenally. So if you feel like you're being too lazy and you don't want to be laying in bed being lazy-er, then come out here and take a nap on this couch because it was just so comfy. Then if you need some writing space, computer space, things like that, they have a very nice desk area set up, um, tons of space. They also have a Siri over there so you can hook up your devices and have Siri play you music or do whatever you'd like to do with your series. And finally, of course, they've got the view. So once again, you're staring out the waves and seeing all the beautiful things. And in this room, just as the other, the doors completely bifold and you can have your open air. Finally, even though I know the water suite was very nice on the inside, this is the reason that hubby and I are in an over water suite. It's this balcony. And I can tell you that it is 
just so relaxing and enjoyable. The hammock is made of a nice plastic, so it's not a, a rope that'll burn you. So the first night that we were here, Hubby and I came out here about nine o'clock and laid out here and watched the stars and fell asleep for about four hours. It was such a great experience. Then you have your great ladder which allows you to actually get in the surf and snorkel around and see what's going on. They provide a fresh water sprayer when you get out to get the salt water off. It has super pressure and we really enjoyed getting rinsed off and then kind of hanging out and drying before we went inside. The view, I'm sorry, I cannot tell you I've been anywhere that has a view of the ocean nicer than this. Look at that electric blue and that teal and it is like this this is also the side that gets the sunset so if you sit out here you get to watch sunsets over these amazing waves they provide also two chase lounges so in the mornings it's nice to be in the chase lounges but because we are on the west by the end of the afternoon it does get a little hot out here so you just kind of prepare for that Finally, they also provide a cute table and chair. So we have actually had um, our coffee out here and our tea out here and just enjoyed sitting underneath the great star lant lantern that, that lights up at night. This is by far the best reason to be here. This view, this experience just rejuvenates your soul. So it's worth it to spend the money and get the over the water suite. It is just so worth it. If you like to snorkel, this whole area is available for snorkeling. We were able to see turtles, sharks, mantas, so many types of parrotfish. Now, if you wanna find other ways of enhancing your stay at Simmon Valley, check out this video listed here.